So that's why that sunflower was displayed there. So the truth is also the roof. Now I'm getting close to my conclusion. When children, oops, when children sex from home, it gives them the ability to have confidence in you and themselves. They build trust. They build trust and can confide so many things in you. They will discuss their first menstruation with you. Their boyfriends, their girlfriends, their highs and their lows. Most of us mothers don't even know when our daughters had their first menstruation in life. Once that happens, then there are chances that you are not close to them. But go back and check. There are friends that they play around with in the neighborhood. They know when they when this other person had their first menstruation and how it came and how they responded. Sometimes, it is even these other friends of theirs who will tell them what to do when their first blood spills. Well, you, the parent, don't even know. A good parent is a good friend of especially their daughters. Your son, you must be able to know girlfriend of your son, he must be able to come home and discuss with you freely. Mom, that baby is giving me a headache. What's the matter? Then he will tell you. Once this is not happening, then your communication line is dead. This way, they can trust and confide in their spouses because that is a lesson they have learned from the home. And they want to bring up better children than they were. The moment your children do not discuss issues like this with you, it is a sign that you are not a good parent. Your ability to provide every material thing for them does not make you a good parent. Knowledge of sex from the home gives the child clear, sound, and reliable information based and good attitude that leads to a happy future. He or she appreciates his or her own rules and that of the opposite sex. The child can be satisfied with these roles, accepting every part of his or her body and every phase of his or her life. It remains.